here to do a quick update video. I'm all dressed up to go to the gym because it is quite early in the morning and I woke up too early. So I got ready and I'm going to sit update wise. So this is my fourth week into a training program that was written for me. I got this training program in April. It is now September. I started in August on August 19th. It took me forever to actually get into it because I had all these excuses like I had Wimbledon to do so I couldn't do that. I haven't got a holiday, so I wanted to start when I could actually do it properly. So anyways, I managed to start how many hours later and it's going well. I'm in pain right now, which is good. I've been going every day, Monday to Friday, at around 9am. And basically doing strength training, so like weights and also a bit of cardio, but not really, not, not that much cardio. Mainly like weight training. Yeah. And then I also started doing IF, which is it, I can never say the word. Intermittent fasting, which I started almost a week ago. I think I'm on my sixth day or something. And that's basically where you only eat for a certain amount of time a day. So I eat between 10 a.m. and 6 p.m. So basically when I wake up, go to gym at nine, come back home, it's pretty around 10, so then I eat. And then I basically have my last meal just before the six, and then I don't eat after that. Sometimes I eat, I'll have like, I'll have water all throughout, and I'll also have some green tea with a bit of honey in. But that will fill me up a bit. So far it's going well. I've noticed that I'm tired a lot lately. I've been getting tired around 8 p.m., which is like, wow. So basically it's draining me, but um, it's going well. I haven't suffered that much. I only really suffer when I stay up late, like up until three or something, then I start feeling hungry like I need food. But other than that, it's been okay. It's kind of hard when you go to your friend's house and then they've eaten a bit late and you have to like take home food rather than eat it there. But yeah, it's good. Oh um, well. I tried to dye my hair yesterday, guys. Does it look any different to you? Look, 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 look it's in twists now. Let me show you. I thought, yeah, let me get some hair dye. I dreamt about this style that I wanted to dye it, like dye some of the ends here and one random bit at the end there. I got this dye. And it did not work. My focus got crap. Anyway, it didn't work. So I don't really want to go through the whole bleaching process and then dyeing this. I don't think it's worth it. So yeah, well, um, what else? Yes, no combs. I want to start a no comb challenge for one month. I haven't combed my hair in a while, but I used a comb to like pick the sides. You know when you do a twist out and I kind of lift it. So I want to stop doing that as well. Use my fingers because people do that. Um, I think. I'm going to start this challenge today, see how it goes, because a lot of people don't use combs, but I for one use them all the time, so I want to see how that goes, I'll only be using, oh my mess, let me find this thing, yes, so at the Women in the Jungle event, I went and spoke to her dad, I think he was, and he was selling this, he was selling these combs, I thought let me buy one just for the sake of it, it was a pound and I think I'll only be using this to do parts if I'm clearing my hair or something because I do want straight parting so I won't be combing my hair out but for parts I'll be doing that and then parting it with my hands wish me luck on that I think that's all oh yeah wheat grass crap back to the training thing fitness thing basically I bought wheat grass because people have been recommending it to me um I've used it basically put it in water in orange juice in about six ounces of this I miss mean, 16 ounces sorry of orange juice in here and then I put the wheat grass one tablespoon of wheat grass in the powder and I would show it to you but it's downstairs 
doesn't taste too bad. It only tastes bad if you don't put enough juice. But it's quite powdery. I was using it for six days and then I stopped because I couldn't be bothered. But I used to jump back on it. Um, what effects have I noticed? I've noticed pooping more regularly, like daily, more daily kind of thing. And that's the only thing I can really say I've noticed. Maybe because I haven't used it for long enough. basically my updates. I'll post some like progress pictures probably uh, by the end of the year because I don't want to be posting it monthly. I'll rather do it when there's actually big progress and then you can see like I take pictures, I'll take a picture. For the IF I'll take a picture weekly and for my training I'll take a picture monthly but so you can see it's better that way isn't it when you have I'm all week, whatever, and you can see the different pictures from the previous weeks. So you can see the progress there. That's what I'll do. And yeah, I need to go to the gym. It's glutes day today. Did my arms yesterday. Yeah. See ya.